So in this video we will see the Cormac and Lamberti classification of facial cuteness flaps. We will first see the anatomical structures. So this is the skin. Below the skin we have the fascia. Below that we have our muscle. So this is the muscle. And then we also have bone. So now Cormac and Lamberti has classified, they have classified the facial cuteness flaps into four types A, B, C and D. So this is for A, this is for B, this is for C and this is for D. So type A. Type A. This is reverse A. We have multiple perforators at one end of the flap. Type B, we have a single perforator. Type C, you can call it a U, you can call it a C we see it from this way it is a C. So type C is multiple segmental and small vessels. Type D. Type D is like type C but it has got osteomyocutaneous perforators. So Again, these are going through the bone, through the muscle. So this is osteomyocutaneous perforators. So if we see the examples, so type A is the classical pontons multiple perforators at the base of the flap. Type B, single solitary perforator supplies the flap at the base. Type C, multiple segmental perforators. So here, here we can assume that a single perforator flap is there at the base. So perforator flaps are examples of type B. Type C is multiple segmental perforators, radial artery, forearm flap comes into this and type D again radial artery forearm flap with radius. So that makes it a osteomyofacial goodness flap or osteofacial goodness flap. So this is the Cormac and Lamberti classification of facial goodness flaps. Thank you.